Late in April, my computer crashed on me, and I had a lot of stuff on there. Um, one of them was this project that I was working on. It got erased. I lost everything. And I was just about to upload that to YouTube when it crashed. I was working on it, and I was just to the point of uploading it and that happened and I was sick <laughs> I tell you because it was a really nice project I liked the way it turned out and I was wanting to really show it but let me give you some ideas of what it uh, actually was all about I had this coffee table okay it was painted with a gloss black it had always been that way um, for as long as we'd owned it and the top was getting kind of pitted and worn from use it was old and you know had seen its better days now in this picture I'm showing you it's from a Thanksgiving when I'm uh, ejecting my turkey with wine um, you can see the top the top doesn't look too bad from this side it's uh, actually the opposite side that's the worst and you don't see that until you know you get on the other side but uh yeah i had to sand it down and everything and as i was sanding off the top it uh had gotten down to levels of a veneer and it had gone through the veneer some of the places and so it was really crappy looking and I had to do a decoupage around the top and then I did a little bit more to it as you'll see in these pictures and I'm describing but here's another picture uh, that you can see from the side you know it was solid black and here we go with the rest of it now okay I want to show you this I had made a project and it was probably one of the best ones I've ever done. I thought I took this old black coffee table and I took a piece of an old bed frame. And this was hollow in the middle and I put a box down inside it. And as you see, I put some stuff down in there and added lights to it so now it's display space on the outside along the edges I uh, hit it with some brass wax polish and all that after I repainted it black I tried to do the top but it was pitted up really bad in places and I tried sanding it down to get some of the the places out and it went right through that uh, layer on there and got down into the the ugly pressed board in beneath and it made such a mess and I was so bummed out so I had to do this pattern then it's a Celtic knot pattern. I did it the whole way around, as you can see. And I was so proud of this project. I did it for under $15. Well, actually, now it's a little bit more because the lights that I had put in I didn't ha like them because uh, they were on a timer and this is plugged in through a USB port and so I can have it all the time if I wanted which it kind of has been since I put it in there but yes originally I did the whole project for uh, hmm it was about fourteen dollars something like that I needed to buy some brackets to hold the box in place. Didn't need the wood or anything. Um, 
because that was part of the waterbed, you see. Um, and the bottom was the headboard, part of the headboard. And uh, it was real 80s style, ugly. You know, we were gonna throw it out. So uh, I was like, hey, wait a second. Let me try doing something with it. And so uh, I got two pieces out of it. I got this and I got a round circle piece here that we're setting on top of this ottoman um, because the top, there's a spring out in the middle. What I'm gonna do is take off the upholstery on top underneath here and uh, pad this, set this down in, in place and then cover over this part with some fresh material. But that's another project down the line. Anyway, I had this all filmed up. I was getting ready to put it up on YouTube and my computer crashed and all my files were on it that I was working with at the present time and I lost everything. I just wanted to show you all the project that I did that you never got to see. So, there it is. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.